Hey, Lori Valen here in Las Vegas with Lori Valen team. And I'm making this video because somebody asked me for a new video on smart plans because there's been some changes with KW. So today I posted on Facebook that I got this text from myself and how unexpected it was to get a text from myself. And then that I had forgotten I put myself on a KW command smart plan. And a lot of people have not yet set up any smart plans. So this video is for you if you want to know more about it. So this text message here says, Hi, Lori Ballen. It's Lori Ballen. <laughs> Though you're likely not ready to jump into anything yet, are there any questions I can answer for you in the meantime? All right. So the first thing we're going to do is I'm going to open the contact record for that text message, which as we know, is Lori Ballen, because it just said Lori Ballen. You can see here it says last contacted February 3rd. That happens to be today, two hours ago, which is when I got the text. So we're right on point. And if you look over here, we can actually see the text that was sent. Hi, Lori Ballen. Okay. All right. So this is being populated through a couple of things. The first thing is that you must have Twilio set up. Twilio is the text message software. So what we're going to do is I'm going to go up here to where my picture is, click on that little arrow, and we're going to go down to settings. Next step when we go, when we get to settings is, let it load up there, go down to Twilio, see Twilio here, and you're going to click connect if you've not connected yet. Now what you're going to do, I have another video I think that actually shows you the back end of Twilio. You're going to go over to Twilio and you're going to choose a phone number, okay? And Twilio is not free. They do charge for text messages. Go ahead and read uh, whatever you need to read about pricing. It's like 0.0742 cent of a cent for a text message. It's really cheap. So I put 20 bucks on my account and then if it runs out, I put more money in there. Um, I have used Twilio myself for years through uh, Turbo Dial, but I've never used it with command. So there are some cool things we're going to be able to do. The drawback right now is that we're not getting our text messages um, responses the way we want to. Okay, but if you just want to know today about smart plans, I'm going to go to the left hand side here and I'm going to click on smart plans. So step one, go set up Twilio and get your phone number picked out. If you're hearing that pop popping, my cat is trying to sit on the microphone. Okay, so you're gonna go ahead and go set up your uh, Twilio account, and get your phone number. Now, if you're seeing an Austin phone number instead of your area code that you pick, you, meet, you need to contact Twilio and ask them to change that to your local number. And I also have a video on that, as a matter of fact, that my brother Jeff set up for us. But it, it can be done, okay? So your text messages do store in the contact record itself. I don't believe yet that they're coming, to, the responses are coming to, um, I, I don't know if the, if the responses yet are coming to our phone. At one time we could only see them in the command record. So I know they're working on all that, but at the very least, it is cool to be able to set up these campaigns and send text messages. So what you have here in your library of smart plans, you have a monthly neighborhood nurture, a bi-weekly neighborhood nurture. We already know about those. Those are the uh, neighborhood nurture snapshots that go out, right? Then you have other like to-do plans. So you can take a look at all of these. Right here, there's something called an open house follow follow up. And if you click on view steps, you can see anywhere this says send SMS, that is the text that's going to the phone. Okay, so we have that in the open house plan. And we also have, let's see, SMS automation in the birthday plan and we also have it in the eight by eight plan so all you have to do is click on view steps and you can see what they are now to edit the smart plans we are going to 
go to My Smart Plans. You can click on here, and over on the right, you can click Edit. When you click Edit, it'll make a copy of the Smart Plan that you want to edit. Oh, I already have that one, so we won't worry about that. Let me just see if I can get one of these to open here. And then what you can do is you can edit right here. You can edit what is in the text message. Now, I heard um, Josh saying that shortly after family reunion, like the March, April timeframe, we should have complete capabilities to start a smart plan from scratch and build our own. For right now, they're a combination of to-dos, like make a call, send a letter, whatever, and automated text messages. So if it says your Twilio account is connected and it's an automated SMS, this is what it's sending. If you want to change anything in there, you can change it and save your smart plan. And then to assign somebody to your smart plan, I'm gonna go back into contacts. Just pick the person that you want to assign to a smart plan. Go up to the right hand side here, click smart plans, add to smart plan, and then pick which one you want them to subscribe them to. And as you can see here, it says subscribed if they are subscribed to that plan. Okay, so keep in mind that Anytime you see anything that says automated SMS, that text message is going to them. Don't be upset later when you say, I didn't know a text message was going to go out. It's going to go out. If, it's, if you're connected to Twilio and you've subscribed to that person and it has an SMS text capability, they're going to get your text message. Okay? So that is all there is to it. Now, after... Uh, after we have the capability to start one from scratch, I will make you a tutorial video on how to make one from scratch. Let me know if you have any questions. I'm happy to make videos wherever you need it.